Hey guys, Technometry here with the video for guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to hard reset your iPhone 12 mini in order to fix any issues you're experiencing with your iPhone. Now, this is the number one troubleshooting step Apple recommends whenever it comes to fixing your iPhone software, even hardware related issues. So, let's get started. First thing is you're going to locate the volume up and volume down button. We'll need to press and release the volume up and then press and release the volume down quickly one after another and then come over to the right hand side and hold this big side button until the screen goes completely black and once you see the Apple logo appear you'll let go of that side button so it's going to be volume up volume down and then you hold that side button just like that now your message will ask you to slide to power off but you do not need to do any of that we're just simply holding that side button until the screen goes completely black and once we see the Apple logo appear we'll let go of that side button and that basically shuts down the phone software and reloads the code. So if it's a software related issue, it will be fixed. This method is safe. It will not delete any of your personal data like photos, videos, apps, documents, anything you have will still be on your phone. You don't have to worry about this method. And if it doesn't work the first time, you might have to do it a few times to get the hang of it. So just press volume up, volume down quickly, and then hold that side button just like that. And if some reason Siri activates, that means you didn't press volume up and volume down quickly. So go ahead and try that again. Volume up, volume down, and then hold that side button. Again, this method, you can do it as many times as you need to, a few times sometimes to fix any software related issue that you're having. So go ahead and try it. Again, this method is known as hard reset or a force restart. And you can do it with pretty much any iPhone that you have if you're having any issues. As you can see here, once you're back on, it will fix any of your issues and you should be good to go. And I hope this video is helpful. If so, please consider hitting that like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone and other iOS devices. See you guys next time.